Hi guys and welcome to another Bootstrap 4 video. This is Jamie from System22 and WebDesignandTechTips.com. Well we're going to continue on with our Bootstrap 4 Basics project here. We've put this site together. We're getting to the end of it now. What I'd like to do is add a bit of smooth scroll so when we click on one of our call to action buttons here it takes us somewhere but it will scroll there smoothly. So say we want to go to this welcome section here. Let's, if I just look at our root folder here, here's our root folder with all our files in it. Here's our index.html, which is our home page we're looking at here. I'm going to open it with my brackets text editor. If you don't have a text editor, brackets is absolutely free and you can download it from a link below this video. Okay, so I want to scroll to here. Welcome to Bootstrap. So I'm going to give this section an ID, not a class, an ID, so we can actually scroll to it. Um, I guess we'll call it Welcome. Okay, now we've got our ID in there. How do we scroll to it? Well, let's go up to one of our buttons. Here's our carousel, here's our button. Say the button success that says start today. Well we want, let's make it scroll to our welcome section, ID of welcome, so it has to be hashtag. Got the hashtag in there already, and welcome. Name of the ID of the section we want to scroll to. And what about this one? This one's about, third slide. Here, let's do this one as well. Start today. Welcome. Okay, let's save that. Go back to the site and refresh. Move this one out of the way. Do a refresh. Let's go back to the top of the site. Okay, so if I hover over that, it should say welcome. Hashtag welcome down the bottom. It does. So what happens when we click on it? Well, it takes us straight to that Welcome to Bootstrap 4, which is great. It's where I wanted to go. But I'd prefer it if, let's see which one, the Start Today button. Instead of just jumping there, it sort of scrolled down there. So let's add what they call a bit of smooth scroll to this site. So I'm going to go over to GitHub here, and I'll put this link below the video. Here's the code for the smooth scroll. And if we look down, I'm going to grab the CDN, Content Delivery Network, so we can grab it offline. So I'm going to grab this whole line here. Control C to copy. Go back to my page. And remember, any page you want to use smooth scroll on, you're going to have to do this on. I'm just going to use it on this page today because of the buttons there but other times you'll have other sections you want to go to. I'm going to just pop this script after our last script on the page here. It's fine. What else do we need to do? It's telling us how we do it. We've done that already. We've got our anchor in there. And we just want to add this to initialize it. This bit of script right here. Control C to copy and we'll paste that just under where we pasted that last bit. That should pretty much do it. Control S to save. Back to the site. Let's refresh. Now when I click on this button it should smoothly scroll down there. You see? Just sort of rolls down there. Which is just exactly what we want. And you can use that to anchor different sections on your site on different pages. Just remember, if you're going to put it on a different page, then you need to put that script on the, the bottom of the page that you're working on. For instance, if we had a button here, learn more or something, you could have it take us down to this section here. You can actually have it take you to a section on another page by putting the .html, then the anchor tag. So there you have it. There's how to add smooth scroll to your site so you can smoothly scroll to various sections. 
I hope you found that useful and enjoyed it. If you have, please give it a thumbs up, comment, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you're interested in web development, take a look down below. We've got some great free courses down there as well as some premium courses with some huge discounts for our YouTube subscribers. So do check it out. Once again, this has been Jamie with System22 and WebDesignDetectives.com. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.